we're going to do a writing lesson on good and bad analogies. And we're going to use Red by Taylor Swift as an example because almost the entire lyrics are analogies. We're going to start by looking at the weakest analogy in this, which is in the chorus. Forgetting him was like trying to know somebody you never met. I have two problems with this. One, it's confusing, okay? Even though analogies are figurative language, I believe that a strong analogy is one that literally makes sense. And this one doesn't make sense. For trying to know somebody you never met is not something that you do. I know that she's trying to say that it's impossible to forget him, but it just doesn't really make sense. The second thing about it is that she's actually saying here the opposite of what she means, right? Forgetting someone is like trying to not know somebody you have met. So it's just unnecessarily confusing. She does have very strong analogies in this though. Um, really love in the beginning. Uh, loving him is like the colors in autumn so bright just before they lose it all. She's saying it's beautiful but doesn't last very long. Uh, similar analogy from the very beginning. Loving him is like driving a new Maserati down a dead end street. Now if you pause and you think about this analogy, you'll understand exactly what she's saying. That it's something exciting and luxurious, but it doesn't last long. You're on a dead end street. She goes on to actually explain it for you, faster than the wind, passionate as sin, ending so suddenly. This is eloquent. It's not 100% necessary, but it does strengthen the analogy. So when you write analogies, really think about whether what you're writing is a strong analogy. There's my lesson. Follow for more writing tips and happy writing.